Hey guys, this is Andrew from RC Boca, and today I'm going to unbox and take a look at the unique Typhoon H. This is a hexacopter professional uh, camera platform with retractable landing gears, a 360 uh, viewing angle, uh, 4K, 30 frames per second camera. Uh, this is the pre-order edition that comes with the unique uh, wizard or wand, uh, so you can use it handheld without the big controller. But without the further ado, let's go ahead and take it out of the box and see what it looks like. So let's go ahead and take it out of the box. Uh, there's one little latch right here. Oh, wow. So, looks like it comes in a case of sorts, a foam little case. Take that off, and let's pull this out of the box itself. Get the box out of the way. So this is what you're gonna see straight out of the box. You'll have the, the Typhoon itself, a battery, a charger, a uh, power inverter, the unique wand. Uh, the huge controller and some other miscellaneous stuff like the propellers and stuff like that. Let's go ahead and take everything else out uh, individually. So here's the battery. It is a Power 4 Series 5400 milliamp 14.8 volt lithium polymer battery. Uh, almost the same weight as the original Q500 battery. Of course, there's an extra cell in there for more power. There's the charging cradle. Uh, very basic, but looks like it will work perfectly. Just slides in. Charges just like so. Here is the power inverter for the charger. It is a uh, output of 4.74 amps, so it should charge this battery in about an hour and 15 minutes-ish. Uh, here is the cigarette lighter charger. This is great. You plug it right into the charging cradle, and you can charge it in the car. It also has a USB output, perfect for the uh, remote. Well, not a lot of complaints with the original Q500, they just gave you the USB cable and no charging adapter. I believe. I'm not 100% I'm not sure, but some of them did not come with it. Here is the unique uh, wizard wand. We give you a little uh, lanyard, along with a Velcro strap for your wrist, and a water-resistant pouch, which is great. Double sealed here. Here is a wand alone. A uh, good weight to it, nothing too crazy. Has a little clip so you can clip it onto your pocket or something. Uh, it has GPS in here so it'll follow you if you have this on you or you can actually control the, the uh, X with this. Other stuff in the box, we have the propellers in here and in here. I don't know what this is, but let's see. Uh, in here, it looks like you get the actual. Uh, lanyard for the remote, the big remote, and a charging adapter. It looks like a PC Type B, uh, for like laptops and stuff. Plug it right into the power inverter. Here's a little uh, shade for the remote. This one actually looks like it clips on instead of the suction cup style like the old one did. Just like so. Here is the huge. When I say huge, it's a huge remote, along with some instructions. Little handle right here. It is a full tablet, 9.7 inches uh, screen, touch screen. A bunch of different uh, little, a ton of stuff basically. Even also has HDMI output for a bigger screen, which is great. And a huge complaint with the old model, the antennas were not user replaceable. Now they are. You can screw it right off, put on even an antenna booster or a better antenna. That's great to see. This also has a removable battery pack, a huge 6700 milliamp 3.6 volt lithium ion battery. So let's move this all the way and get to the quad or hexacopter itself. Comes out just like so. Uh, looks like that's it for the uh, box. Just a bunch of silica gel to for any moisture. The arms snap up just like so. You can hear a nice little, uh, you should be able to hear a nice little click, just like so. All carbon fiber uh, arms. Some nice, I'm not sure what KV motor these are, but looks very, very nice. There is the camera, uh, Tego 3 Plus with the 360 degree viewing angle. You can take that off and actually spin it around 360 degrees over and over, which is awesome. And here you have some instructions. 
You have some morning stuff, a no before you fly pamphlet, the status indicator for the lights, some other miscellaneous stuff, a quick start guide, and even a uh, user little user manual. It's kind of odd. The user manual is smaller than the quick start guide. But all in all, that is the first look of the unique Typhoon H. We'll be having a bunch of other videos showing the uh, certain modes, uh, more in depth on the controller, and even the follow me, the curved cable, all the different modes this thing has, which is amazing. Uh, but yeah, that is the unboxing and first look of the unique Typhoon H from Unique. This is a hexacopter, fully professional-wise uh, drone platform. But I'm Andrew. Thanks for watching.